We were up for some rest and relaxation before the next legs of our travels after an amazing time in Malaysia, and we booked this five-star Muslim-friendly hotel. Now, we'd never heard of a Muslim-friendly hotel. I just thought everybody was supposed to be friendly in general. But let's go explore together and see exactly what it means to be at a Muslim-friendly hotel in Kuala Lumpur, Malaysia. The uh, Muslim-friendly hotel, the design of the actual hotel itself is um, designed after the prayer motion of the hands which goes this way so you'll see it has a big arch but the top goes like this so very cool and they also have uh, women's only facilities so there's a family swimming pool where men children um, and women can be together but there's also just the women's only section the thing to keep in mind about this hotel is that it's alcohol free uh, again because you know muslims don't drink uh, so mm, very nice what is this Ice chocolate. Ice chocolate. Okay. Although you can drink in the room, like in private, but I mean, it doesn't we really matter that, to us. But, I mean, I don't know if that's supposed to be like a shh sh thing or whatever. But um, I'm more yeah. excited about the chocolate than the alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> this is a video, babe. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay, so we're at terminal door one, door three, and our hotel taxi will be coming soon. Moving pick, yeah. Hi. Two. Leon or Jennifer? Leon and Jennifer. Leon and Jennifer? Yeah, we already have someone waiting. Just now I, think. I call you. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, oh, yeah, <laughs> Thank you, sorry. Oh, very full. Little full in there. Full. Okay, you can wait. I drop there. Can I do? I come back? Yeah, okay. okay. No problem. Yeah, thank you. Very much. Yeah, thank you. Okay, okay. Okay, thank you. I, I mean, it'd be good to check that at first. You know? <laughs> we only have small suitcases too. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so we have just arrived at the Moven Pick Hotel. So we are here overnight. It's really pretty. Look inside. <laughs> I have to say though, the transfer in comparison, <laughs> the transfer vehicle in comparison to the hotel, they could improve on that a little bit. <laughs> Honestly, not to be fussy, but you know, it's true. All right. So let's check in. Hi there, how are you? Yes, please. Okay. So we are on our way. Here's the view. I love the view. Very beautiful. So we are going to the seventh floor, which is the highest floor, I believe. On top is only the king. Welcome to the Moven Pick Hotel. We are in the executive class room. This is um, the room that has the lounge area, you know, all the good coffee and teas. We've got the pods, the pods, no instant coffee for Jen. <laughs> Makes me happy. Okay. <laughs> Um, they have a really nice uh, business center here where Leon and I can both sit and edit and work on our blog, which is fantastic. Under lighting for the closet, which is a beauty. Definitely, man, like for me, when you've got the bathrobes, it's really nice. I love that it's lit up. Extra pillows, which is great. Um, we'll go hang these in a minute. Right, so big full-length mirror, which is definitely something that a lot of hotels miss out on. <laughs> and we have this sitting area right here. So two big, huge, nice armchairs, super comfortable, lovely big screen TV. Um, obviously, big, huge window. We'll show you the view. 
We've got the underlighting he all here. Ooh, look at that. And the hotel, but we like to see the greenery, so that's beautiful. And we have, look at this. Look at the colors over here. Absolutely incredible. Big king size bed, lots of pillows, lots of extra pillows. Six no. Didn't even notice the basket. No, I did not. Oh, oh look at the that. towels. Oh, Beautiful. This is oh, cool. this is the prayer towel. Look, so this is your, I think this is your prayer mat. That's your prayer mat, prayer yeah, and the Quran. With the Quran. Yeah. This is definitely a Muslim friendly hotel. The design of the actual hotel itself is. Um, designed after the prayer motion of the hands which goes this way so you'll see it has the big arch with the top goes like this so very cool nice end tables which is perfect i know that's one of the <laughs> pet peeves is when i don't have an end table <laughs> my, my favorite thing about this hotel or this the oh i believe that may be our luggage, our luggage. Yeah, it is. <laughs> oh you have to check the luggage stop filming all right Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Getting low on cash because we leave tomorrow. There you go. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Bye. Bye. <laughs> Problem is when you're leaving, like the next day, we try to get rid of all of our cash. So, okay. Perfect. Always nice to tip people of service and just be kind and generous and share the blessings you have to help bless others and it blesses you in return. So excited about it. I love Asia, but one of the most challenging things for me is to find a bath. And Leon and I absolutely yeah. love having a nice hot bath. So Good soak. This it is so Look at the size of it. Wow. <laughs> That's going to take a while to fill up. <laughs> Oh, fantastic. Where have you gone? I've come. Just have to do this, because look, this is the best part. <laughs> okay, and we have a nice big shower in here. Double sliding door. Privacy in the toilet. Privacy here. Oh, I didn't even realize you're supposed to do it. Yeah. Hmm. Excellent. And of course, think the, I mean, the only thing I guess I would say that could be a little nicer would have been his and hers. Uh, <laughs> I just wanted to mention when I was saying that it's like a Muslim hotel, I meant like it's more Muslim friendly. Like you saw there, there's the prayer mat and um, the Quran. Uh, they also have uh, women's only facilities. So there's a family swimming pool where men, children um, and women can be together. But there's also just the women's only section. Um, and also for the gym, there is a man's gym and a woman's gym to, to keep things separate. So you don't have to be separate and it is not only for people who practice Muslim, of course, but I love that it's respected um, in that regard. Another thing to keep in mind about this hotel is that it's alcohol free, uh, again, because you know Muslims don't drink. But um, I'm more yeah. excited about the chocolate than the alcohol. <laughs> <laughs> and, and the next thing that you're gonna see in this video is we were invited to uh, the chocolate hour where they feature a lot of uh, sweet Swiss chocolate and we're gonna go from three till four so we're gonna show you guys that uh, soon <laughs> um, we're gonna get checked in settled in I'm gonna have a proper coffee so yay <laughs> Very nice. What is this? Ice chocolate. Ice, Ice chocolate. chocolate. Okay. okay. <laughs> Thank you. Ice chocolate. All right. Thank you. Okay. Thank you. Chocolate hour. We get our own little chocolate. So you just choose what you want. These are only display, but look how cute they are. Well, you know, I'm going straight for a white chocolate bowl. <laughs> and I'm going for this one. And I'm going for this one. You take all the balls. <laughs> I'm not going to go for this one. <laughs> 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 <
This is a video, babe. Oh. <laughs> I'm always taking a photo. I will after, I will. So we, we didn't realize because it says the display here. So I thought all of this was part of the display, but we can actually try these. Look at these. Oh my goodness. So Leon's happy. My plate is going to get loaded right now. Actually, watch What happened, babe? Two years of having hardly any white chocolate. What happened, babe? It's like a white chocolate pie. There's like nobody else here. Leon's like, oh, can I take it all to the room? Uh, chocolate was great, but the white chocolate especially was excellent. Especially one with the orange inside. Yeah. Really I love um, I love all of the types of chocolate that have nuts. Like these have like slivers of almonds. And... I believe it's complimentary as well. It's just amazing. You need dinner when you can just eat chocolate. <laughs> Perks of the executive stay. And over here, later on, um, there are coffee and tea and drinks and also samples from the chef. So there's finger foods and things also. Wow. <laughs> hey. Emma, what's your feedback? little kids club in here if you have some kiddos <clears throat> wow look at this oh, for weddings if you want to have a wedding here it's an example of how they could decorate the hall for you wow ready for our wedding babe Yeah, he's done really well.
起了。Going to India. Today is the day we're going to India. I want to, but I don't want to leave this bed. I'm going to India. I'm not too comfy. But first, we're gonna have an amazing buffet breakfast. Mm -hmm. But we're going to India. Going to India. So I'm not sure what's this. Looks like a cool, like bar area. Look at this. Look. Wow, this place is so cool. Wow. Wow. Very impressed. Hello. Hey, <laughs> thank you. believe we're going know, to India. This is like a big travel deal for yeah. us. It's a, you know, a lot, you get people telling you all sorts of different things like go, don't go, you're gonna love it, you're, it'll be difficult, you get all these warnings and I always get a little bit nervous before yeah. every trip, um, but this one especially, but I'm so excited. We can't wait to explore. We have epic itinerary and yeah. Yeah, we're going to a lot of different cities. It's going to be a lot of um, local transportation as well. Uh, yeah. Some flying, but lots of buses, yeah. uh, taxis. Um, yeah, trains. it's going to be trains as well. Yeah, trains, so. planes, and automobiles. Yeah. And we're going to see our friends Jackson and Mayo in the air. They'll be landing before us. Really looking forward to that as well. Yoo-hoo! Yoo-hoo! Hello! Hello! Hey, Leon! <laughs> you guys are deaf. <laughs> oh, so it's gonna be amazing. I um, can't wait. I mean, this has been a, a long term dream of ours. We've, we've got a lot of friends uh, from India on Instagram uh, as well. So. Um Thank <laughs> you. 